Hi, this is Krishnakant Mane welcoming you to yet another tutorial in the Orca series. Right from the tutorial on first time with Orca till cut copy paste, we have seen various aspects in which Orca provides complete speech feedback for all the activities we do on the desktop. This tutorial is about a small yet very powerful application called Tomboy. Before we go ahead, let me introduce you to the reader of this tutorial. With me is Ujwala Pawade who will be reading the script while I will be performing the activities on the desktop. So over to Ujwala. Hi, this is Ujwala. In a few tutorials before this, we have already learned to create a file and open it back in a text editor. But have you ever faced a situation wherein you quickly needed to take down notes and organize them nicely? Well, I guess many of us do face this situation often. May it be an important meeting or a crucial lecture. We always need to take down notes. If like me, you too have been searching for a tool to help you take notes, then Tumbo is the perfect solution. In this tutorial, I am going to introduce you to this amazing tool and we will see how efficiently Orca assists us while using it. Let's start exploring Tomboy right away. Since we are using Linux, I am sure Orca is already running. Assuming you are on the desktop, let's open the applications menu. Remember, we press Alt plus F1 to open the menu. Top expanded edge panel frame. Applications menu. Tomboy is available in the accessories menu. So let's press down arrow once to locate it. Accessories menu. Press the right arrow to open the sub menu. Alarm clock. Now keep pressing the up arrow till you hear Orca saying Tomboy notes. X tile. World clock. World clock. Virtual box OSE. Touch commander. Tomboy notes. You see? We could also browse the accessories menu using down arrow, but Tomboy is way down the list, so pressing up arrow goes in the backward direction, letting us locate Tomboy quickly. Now press enter to open the application. Return. Untitled free frame. Application menu menu. Search all notes frame. Search. Combo box text. So, as you, you can hear, Orca promptly tells us that Tomboy Notes is opened for us. Note that Tomboy is a very lightweight software and thus opens quickly. The first thing you will notice is that we are placed in the search box. If you have a lots of notes, this feature helps you to search for a proper note on the basis of words you type here. The notes are arranged into a group called a notebook. But you can also look at all notes at once by selecting the notes option. So let's actually put our knowledge into practice. Press tab to move to a list of notebooks. All notes. Actually this is a two panel window. The first panel contains a list of all the notebooks while second panel contains the list of notes for the selected notebook. Right now Orca is telling us that we have selected the all notes option. This means if you press tab and move to the other panel, you will see the list of all the notes already present in Tomboy. So let's tab over to the list of all available notes. Tab. Note column header. Now Orca tells us that we are on a column called note. The notes panel is a two column list. The first column shows the title of the note. The second column shows the date and time at which it was modified. Since right now we are on the note column, let's press the down arrow to see the first note. It is note column header Ubuntu 14 January 12.47 pm. Not selected. Selected. As you can hear, Orca reads out the name of the first note. Pressing right arrow will tell you the time and date at which it was created or modified. Last changed column header for January 12.47 pm. Press the left arrow again to come back to the name. Note column header Ubuntu 1. 
Do you get it now? The first panel was for the notebook selection while the second panel was a two column list of notes. So let's hit enter on the first note. Return to one frame. As you can hear, Orca tells us that the note is open. Press Ctrl plus Home to go to the top of the note. Down. Use the read all command for reading the note. Remember, it is numpad plus for the desktop or caps lock plus semicolon for the laptop. Ubuntu 1. To avoid it better with Ubuntu 1, the personal cloud must bring your digital life together. Ubuntu 1 does more than sync your files, whether you need to access your contacts, notes or bookmarks from any computer or the web. Enjoy your favorite music from a cloud-integrated store or stream your entire collection to iPhone and Android mobile phones. We've raised the bar on personal clouds. Learn more at http1.ubuntu.com slash already have an Ubuntu 1 account. Set up to boy to sync with your personal cloud by clicking edit, preferences, and then the synchronization tab. Now you can press escape to close this note. Let's search all notes frame. Note column header room to 14 January 12.47 pm. Well, this is good, but we want to create our own notes. So the first thing we will do is to create a notebook for maintaining our notes. Press Alt plus F to open the file menu like this. File menu new control N. With the menu open, press the down arrow to locate the notebook submenu. Notebooks menu. Press the right arrow to open the notebook submenu. New notebook dot dot dot. As you can hear, Orca tells us that the first option is to create a new notebook. This is what we want to do. So let's hit enter on this option. Return create a new notebook type the name of the notebook you'd like to create. Notebook name, text. Orca tells us now that a dialog has opened for us to create our new notebook. Well, Orca is clearly telling us that we are at the edit box where we can type a name for our new notebook. For me, I will type learning Orca. L E A R N I N G learning O R C A Orca backspace space. Now press the shift plus tab key to locate the create button and press enter. Create button. Return. Search all notes frame. Note column header. That's it. We have created our first notebook. We are right now on a list of notes. Press shift plus tab twice to move to the panel containing the list of notebooks. Notebooks column header all notes. Search notebooks column header all notes. Let's use the down arrow to locate the notebook we just created. Unfile notes. Learning Orca. After we locate the notebook, it's now time to create our first note. There are two ways of creating a note. We can pop up the menu for the selected notebook and choose to create a note. This will open a new note for us and it will be directly added to the selected notebook. The second way is very simple, yet the note will not be put into a notebook. In the latter case, you press Ctrl plus N to create a new note. Since the effect is just the same, I shall not cover it in this tutorial. So let's try the first option. Press the pop-up menu key on your keyboard. Window menu. It is generally located to the left of right control key. As you can hear, Orca tells us that a menu has opened. Well, Orca just said menu because right now we haven't selected any menu item. Let's press down arrow to see what all options are available here. New note. The first time we press the down arrow, Orca tells us that we are focused on the new note option. Let's press the down arrow again. Open template note. 
this option is about a note template this means we can also create a new format for our note although we will not be covering it in this tutorial pressing the down arrow again will take us to the delete notebook option delete notebook i guess this option is very obvious so i won't explain its functionality now press the down arrow again to come back to the new note option new note press enter to open a new note Re new note five frame text describe your new note here there we are we can select whatever default text is there start typing our new note we can select whatever default text is there and start typing our new note but hey there is something interesting here the first line of your note will automatically become the heading or note title rest of the text will actually constitute the note so let's select all the text and delete it first for selecting all text we press the control plus a key combination entire document selected as you heard olga promptly responds by telling us that the entire document is selected now press the delete key to erase the selected text delete so now we have an empty note let's type a few things about this tutorial series Have you liked the tutorial so far? Wish to write down some feedback? So let's give a title to this note to start with. I will write Orca tutorial feedback. Press enter and start writing some notes. O R C A Orca T U T O R I A L tutorial F E E D B A C K return for the tutorial feedback well in some subsequent tutorials you will learn to send emails so you can send this feedback to us so remember preserve this note anyways let's start typing something orca is a great screen reader o r c a orca i s is a a g r e a t great S C R E E N screen R E A D E R reader return for Kerala great screen reader. If proper documentation is provided, it looks like the most easy thing to use. I F if P R O P E R proper D O C U M E N T A T I O N document I S is P R O V I D E D provided. I T is S E E S. C T O T B E B T A T L M O S T M O T A S Y E V T A I N G T I N G T O T U S E U S. However, we need to be aware that it takes time to learn new skills. H O W E V E R. However, W E V N E E D N E T O T U K N. W no T A A T not W E V N E E D N E T I M E time T O T O L E A R N learn N E W U S K I L L S return. However, we need to know that we need time to learn new skills. Fine. Now press Escape to close this note. Notebook column header learning orca. Oops! I told you before. You got to save this note, but we closed it without saving it, right? But surprise! One special feature about Tomboy is that you don't have to manually save any note. It gets saved automatically. So don't worry. Your note is saved. As soon as you pressed Escape to close your note, you will be placed on the notes column. which actually contains the list of available notes in this notebook so you can now press the down arrow to see the list of notes start here for january using links in tomboy for january 12:47 pm 
press up arrow to come in the reverse direction. Start here for January, Ubuntu 1 for January, Orca tutorial feedback to May 2026. Now locate the node you just created and hit enter. Report a tutorial feedback frame. Text. There it is. The note has opened. Well, you can actually make your note look more well formatted. Come to the end of the note by pressing Ctrl plus end. End. Let's make a bulleted list of features that Orca offers. For starting a bulleted list, you first type a star and then type the first point. So let us write. Orca is a free and open source screen reader. Asterisk. O R C A Orca I S is A A F R E E free A N D and O P E N open S O U R C E source S C R E E N screen R E A D E R return. As soon as you press enter, the star is converted into a bullet. Now every time you press enter. A bullet point will be created. So let's write another point. Orca helps to do basic desktop jobs. O R C A Orca A C L P F helps T O two B O U B A F I C basic B backspace B E S K T O P desktop J O B S return. Orca can work with Office Suite. O R C A Orca C A N can double O R K work the R T H with O F F I C E O F F U I T E return. Orca assists in surfing the internet. O R C A Orca A F F I S T S assists R N in S U R F F I N E surfing T A E L E dot A I N T E R N E T Return. Now keep pressing the up arrow till you come to the first point. Bullet Orca assists in surfing the internet. Bullet Orca can work with Office Suite. Bullet Orca helps to do basic desktop jobs. Bullet Orca is a free and open source screen reader. You can hear that Orca says bullet before every point. This means we can make a proper list of our points in the note. So press escape to close this note. F untitled to frame. Now you can close Tomboy nodes by pressing Alt plus F4. Search all nodes. Untitled to frame. So did you enjoy taking down nodes with Tomboy? That's it for this tutorial. Until the next time, this is Ujwala and Krishnikant saying goodbye. goodbye.